Hello there people, this is Out of Base and today we will start race at Zolder. I'm not gonna take your time too much, but I will show you something uh, funny, something interesting. So, uh, case in this race is natural selection, as of always, so you can see just waiting for those guys to solve their life problems as there's another one on the left side so people are not having the best day uh, whether it's the first race or the last one some guys just don't have that 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 luck so someone grazing the grass on the inside uh, so we will try to uh, live uh, this race and you can see how Really, really, really bad luck for another guy right there, and we're just abusing those track limits with the curbs. Uh, so the marshals, I bet, were screaming at me, but I can't hear them, so I have a loud engine and a loud car, so uh, there's no warnings for track limits for me, but the Audi was really getting on my nerves so I thought why not just lunge on the inside as he gave me invitation so he's really slow also and really really breaking early so you can see right now how earlier he was breaking in this one in the last chicane so we get on the power really early as you for this one for the last corner you want to uh, short shift to the second gear so you don't spin too much um, right now on the menu are the Nissan up front he had I I couldn't remember right now as I'm uh, making the voiceover but I think he had a mixed race uh, for himself this one so in this video you will see two races in one in one race it ended really calmly I think but the guys are really I don't know what's what's up with Zolder and community in this chicane you can just punch the curb the second curb uh, really hard and you can jump over it so okay right now here guys are fighting and really having really the not the best lines so the Lexus is really slow I think it's growing on the missing guy <laughs> Two, two more guys just decided to kiss each other by the uh, kiss each other at the off the track limits so we will try to get on power but we had some twitch and uh, as you know you can't uh, uh, put the pedal to the metal if you have a twitchy steering wheel so especially with these cars some some say that these guy these cars have really high RPMs. You have to be careful. But another thing that you can do is to signal guys uh, just to uh, getting get into those nerves to um, really bring out the best of natural selection that they can bring. Uh, so that is one thing that I like to do. And you can see the Lexus will just let us pass. Uh, maybe he had some 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 little problems uh, at his uh, sim rig or something. I don't know. That sometimes that's the case with few guys. But uh, if you're relentless enough, you can see how guys will just let you let you pass. So upcoming is the Godzilla right now. And uh, interesting thing that I like to do here is. Uh, see how well I'm doing at consistency you can see how tires temperatures and PSI's are doing you can see also how my lap times are doing where I make most of the mistakes which which corner so that's the third uh, part of the track where my mistakes really shine uh, first sector and the last one so right now really really uh, we're getting really close as the Godzilla makes uh, mistakes and we will signal him in a uh, little lock of uh, another uh, understandment uh, as we are tiny bit faster than him than him 
he's not that slow so I was really surprised that he let me pass so okay this was the race till the end it was fourth place and I was satisfied so next race of today's video is at Monza so you know what's coming uh, and what is coming is the first corner and there's uh, there are many angry guys uh, trying to fight for the position at, as we are sitting right. now in 10th place uh, but the right. scoreboard the right. shows completely different thing as usual but right. you can see natural Clear selection the right. and there we go move man you didn't see nothing uh, best content on YouTube uh, quite honestly it's not something that I'm proud of but I want to move on with my life you know and uh, as we all know, uh, Porsche is really, really good on acceleration and cornering. So it doesn't have the, the best top speed, as everybody knows. But acceleration and cornering should be no problem for the guy. And I don't know what, what happened there. I just decided to, to yeah, just shovelize him out of the way and uh, and just go as the Bentley is a tank of a car and right now we are fast forwarding a lap somewhat uh, and as we are closing in to the group up ahead it's two-way battle uh, actually it's a battle for the first place right now and uh, Ferrari and Lamborghini is really getting on with it as we can see and that uh, gives us enough fortune uh, to get close to them also the more they fight the closer I will get and uh, just in a few minutes you should see uh, what it really is to fight so much that you just uh, start to attract more crowd to yourself uh, and uh, lap times are really good I was really really satisfied with my performance as the, um, Car on the left. Ferrari was on the uh, left. really deep on brakes and was, was not having the best line but we will uh, somewhat calibrate through the first part of the track first corner so again signaling don't forget to signal uh, it, there's always possibility to uh, play on nerves and uh, really really early on brakes uh, Ferrari right here but uh, we will try to keep up with Ferrari on also on acceleration as the Bentley is a tiny bit faster I think on, on straights uh, and maybe on braking, we will see. It depends also on the driver, how well he knows the car and trusts the car. The car. Uh, I'm somewhat moderate. I'm not trusting Bentley fully. I've been driving Bentley for, I think, 200 hours somewhat, even more. And it's been doing me really good, actually, as the Ferrari. Maybe we can have a better exit speed, but not quite. But we will try to gain just enough to maybe have a lunch on the inside and constantly signaling to the guy. Maybe he will make a little mistake, but not this time, I think. As we have a massive, massive oversteer, snap oversteer. That, if you ever wondered how snap oversteer looks like, that's the... Uh, that's the best uh, scenario of how it looks so as the parabolic is is uh, really the place where to understand what is snap oyster so here at the first part we get back on it on uh, ferrari's uh, rear i guess uh, don't want to cuss too much I'm saying enough bad words when I play flag, the PUBG or something like that, but yeah, uh, we will try to maybe, maybe have some 
XTP as there's the back marker spun, spun out. Uh, we'll try to go for the inside. At the first Nesma, we will be alongside for the second one, maybe, but at this point, I thought no, uh, it's not the best place where to fight. I think the best place how you should fight for the position is to get the best, better exit speed and, and uh, make the overtaking possibility on straight. So, not quite gonna happen. So, signaling again uh, that we are incoming for the maybe a little launch but will not happen this time also as he had a poor exit out of the first game we will try to get alongside uh, really 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 claim the inside line for the next chicane and we will try to get it get it done cleanly and we will just break tiny bit later and claim the inside line just force it Maybe not force it, but it's, I think it was a clean move. Uh, nothing wrong about it, but, but really uh, insist on uh, overtaking the Ferrari. So, second place right now, and the pressure is on. Uh, we will try to hold on to the position. As we know, uh, our car is a little bit faster than the... Uh, Ferrari itself, so maybe we can hold on to the position and also catch the leader that is a, 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 a Lamborghini. And we a really bad, 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 bad thing happening. So, bunch of guys will just overtake us. One, that was one, and I think it will be two more, so the Porsche and AMG, so we will try to gain something back. So that's the main interesting thing of this race. Can we claim our position back? Uh, can we catch somebody? So we can see we're... we're getting up on behind of the AMG right now and it's not that bad at this point I thought maybe we will be able to take over him right here in the Parabolica and get a little bit better exit as we know AMG is really fast car so it's gonna be a drag race right now to the first chicane as we see he's al already uh, getting some extra kilometers an hour, so I misjudged the breaking point. That is what mainly happened. But uh, he also was deep on brakes, so we will try to get better traction out of the chicane and really uh, catch him. But uh, you can see the uh, power of the AMG is just too big for this one right here. So. Slow car ahead. We will try to capitalize on braking, and he will go too much, uh, too late on braking, so he had to take a route of the track, and we claim the fifth position, and that will be it for this race, as you can see, uh, fast forwarding right now, to the last corner of the race, so that will be the fifth place, and we did really good actually considering everything um, i'm satisfied i hope you are thank you so much for watching and subscribing and 